how to stretch header to full width on wix hey everyone and welcome i hope you're all doing great in this video i will show you step by step how to do so now this is actually going to be very simple and easy to do and anything that you can actually stretch you're going to be able to do the same method on it and you'll make it full width so anyways all you need to do is just go ahead and go to your wix website and obviously click on edit site on the top right in order to go to the uh, site editor now obviously without even having to say this you would require to have a header in order to do so and if you um, can find one in that case you may have it hidden and i can show you how to uh, unhide the header later on but first let's just show you how to make it full width so let's just wait for this to load and then i'm just going to get back to you so once you actually open up your wix editor all you need to do is just go ahead and click on the header element which should be a strip in order for this to work. If not, it's already going to be full length or, you know, full width, actually, I should say. So if you click on the header now, you should be able to see this uh, icon here. Obviously, you're going to have multiple different ones here for different reasons, but the one that we want is stretched or this um, arrow with two different heads. So all you need to do is just go ahead and click on that, and then you would want to select screen and make it zero pixels obviously you can change it if you want it to be less and it's going to look a little something like that but if you want it to be full width uh, for the screen you just want to select screen and make it sure it is zero and if you select page it's just going to show you uh, in the parts that are actually going to be visible for everybody so in between these two lines so obviously in our case it's just going to be this one with zero and this is going to be also um, usable with any other element that does have this option so for example with this we can just again click on stretched select screen and then we can just go ahead and make sure the margin is zero and you can actually see how it's actually going to look like so uh, if you click on page it's just going to make sure it is between the lines if it's screen it's not going to matter and it's just going to make sure it is full page so for this one i'm just going to keep it as page and this one is pretty much set so what if you don't have that for the header uh, in that case obviously you don't have a strip um, so if you don't have a strip you're not going to see that option because it's by default is going to be full screen so all you need to do is just go to add elements before you add the menu item or logo and you just want to go to strip uh, and just add the strip that you like in my case it's just going to be this one and then just attach to header and then we can just go ahead and minimize this to our liking and then we will be able to basically stretch it to our liking whether it's going to be full page or uh, i mean full width or just you know page sized um, and we can also play around with the margin so this is pretty much all for this video hopefully you found it to be helpful and thanks for watching